Hi, and welcome to Santa's workshop. I sit with a pencil in my, a brush in my mouth, so that's not easy to hear. But you can see in a moment. I have moved around where the stuff is. So. But as you probably have seen, we have uh, made this little cotton town. And now we we'll and uh, we have put some snow on today and I have a made a statue of uh, Santa and I have made a little snow urn uh, what shall we call it these one of these small figures so but now we will make some uh, I was just painting this one and you will see in a minute what I'm up to It's it's all about making stuff yourself and not you can buy everything, but you can also make it yourself. And what I use here is the same stuff that I make our little snowman of. Uh, it's an old oil-based uh, clay, and uh, you can use you can use uh, the same as uh, if uh, I don't know what tradition you have in your country, but here in my country we make Christmas decorations and uh, and to. Uh, uh, Put the uh, spruce and uh, the clay in into those. Uh, we use uh, ordinary pottery clay, and if you have some of that, you can use that. And that, of course, will dry, and this will never dry. So, and there's a lot of other products out there you can use. But uh, I made this up front so that it will dry so we can put it on and I took some of these and I rolled a piece of clay like this in a little bowl and then I squeezed it like this and then I put this little guy on top of it and we have uh, something else here too and this is just so it it stands Take some of this. And if you use oil based clay, then don't uh, put too uh, oil based clay, then don't put too much water in the color because then it will be like water on a duck. So take it.
should put that on here so we can add to it. This is acrylic uh, paint, so be sure to get the brush clean every time because acrylic acrylic paint are more or less glue with some color in it. So when it first is first uh, have dried in the brush, then you will never get it out again. I promise. So. Then I take Then you put a apply a little heat with your hands here, then it's easier to Kind of roll out a comb. Something fun to sit and make with the kid Sunday afternoon. And you can do like this if you want, or you can do whatever you want. See? Now you have. And you will apply some, and then. We need an oops. And you can of course make it more elaborate than we do here.
But the kids will love this. Sit and have fun together. Something in it so that you can hold it. Nose is a little red, red, because of the cold. You should actually. I have, but I have a airbrush like this one, but uh, you don't. So it don't help. Uh, I, I think you don't. I don't know, but uh, it would, would probably not help you. Oops. Now it's hard to. I'm going to go and get something. We will put them in our little Christmas time. Afterwards.
can't do that with that one. some yellow yarn or whatever to make some uh, some hair to it and let make a little lady where do I have my scissors I don't have a scissors here but, uh, We are improvising a little here. Yeah. So found my scissors. So go away. So you can see what we're doing. So we can make some of these. I make it so long that this go out on both sides. But you can make it as crazy as you want. As, as crazy as you have time to. go 
because this was not the plan when I started. And of course you can open up this. So course depending on what you have and then you need to do that so we say this one we will use it is nicer than wire but come on so we see if they are that now so open it up here and
course it has to be. You have more time than I had to do it, so yours will be better. You will not. You don't have any time pressure. Taking a big brush. Well, I'm sure you get the idea of this.
and take this. Oops. Oh, the snowman's carrot got bent. With a little time and a little effort, you can do a lot of fun with that. I'm sure of it, but uh, anyway, that was our little half an hour. Oops, are we breaking the brush too? Little half an hour of fun and see what we will come up with tomorrow. So, for now and for this evening, I will say thank you and goodbye.